Oh, whoa. Whoa, shot up. This is sealed, brand new right here. This is this is 40 grand. It's Friday, we're back. Noah's here to help, thankfully, because I'm a little sore today. And uh, there's a lot of stuff to move. We're gonna try to move this today, right? I'm excited. We're gonna try to get all moved out today over to our storage where we can go through more of the stuff kind of slower, maybe as we sell it. So, Noah's ready, huh? I'm ready. Moving. We're getting all the big stuff first and then we'll come back and get the small stuff with some more bins to uh, stack it neatly. All right guys, so if you didn't see the last couple videos, this is the locker we bought for $7,500. Not at auction, it's a private party deal. And um, it's loaded up with this kind of stuff. Brand new. Brand new, but the estimated 80% of the items here are brand new. I, so far, not, I haven't seen many that aren't. That's cool. Is it board games of some sort? Mm -hmm. And with 20 the receipts. Bucks, 25 bucks. In it. With the receipts, maybe we can return yeah. it. <laughs> yeah. 20. Yeah, this one's sealed still. Chronicles of Crime. Mm -hmm. And then there's a bunch of card games too. So we're going to be bringing these still sealed, all new. These are cool. Yeah. Hello, neighbor. This is all neat, neat titles. Judge Your stuff. Friends. <laughs> so a uh, lot of stuff for the um, auction. Yeah. We'll be selling a lot of this on our whatnot auctions. Mm -hmm. We'll talk a little bit more about that later. All right. So we'll be able to put that in the car and get bring it home. We'll be selling it quick. Might even be sold by the time you guys see the video, but <laughs> that's why you got to come to the auctions. I can't remember if we showed this yet, but this is a board game. It's a board game. Another sealed brand new. You know, I was making quick work of this. Filling that van. And we got the Tesla. We'll bring this home. This will be some of the first stuff we put in the auction. Get it sold quick. Try to get some of our money back on this. We invested a lot on this one, guys. Honestly, I think we should have paid four to five thousand, but it's just Wait, so no cool bills. we couldn't pass it up. Back oh, to that the is really cool. That's awesome. Seven oh three one seven. Try to get a comp on that. That's neat. I know. I love it. And one, it's fun stuff. Like, it's like you can just ship it like this. Merry Christmas. Yeah. Okay. Here are uh, two puzzles right here, and it's very funny. I know. That's so funny. <laughs> I can't say that on YouTube, but. That's what it be. Sometimes life feels like What way. is it? Look, it says. <laughs> <laughs> Keep it classy, San Diego. What is this right here? Oh, look at this. Blockbuster game. Oh my gosh, that's hilarious. It's like a right. Trivial Pursuit or something. Bring home the entertainment again. That is really cool. Neat stuff. Roll the realm. Nice. It's only 12 bucks. Still sealed. Seems cheap. Yeah. 15 bucks and the initiative. Still sealed, 25 bucks. Wow. Look at this. Marvel Zombies Heroes Resistance. Some kind of game. Zombie side game. Zombies. We have Marvel Zombies. Oh, cool. Yeah, that's cool. I'll we'll load put that in the up. Bar. Yep. Tenyo ism, huh? Yeah, I don't know what that Can is. You? Do you? No. Yeah, yeah. Sykes is expensive too. Oh, okay. There's an envelope. Just like I might have some important paper marks. Hmm. Demonstration videos. Magical <laughs> burger. What? Is this some sort of magic thing? Mm. Like professional it's, magic? I don't know. There's only 900 of them made. This looks very professional. Right? It's super heavy. Yeah. Whoa. Volume one and two. What is tenuism? We have to look it up. Hey, right, Richard Kaufman. Hmm. Different. Yeah, right? It's like padding. I mean, these are like books, right? A PSVR. Looks like it might be sealed still. Oh. Ah, do they, people buy those still? I guess. The problem is though. Probably. Yeah, that's like good. Oculus that's, video that game. might be a couple hundred bucks. Oh, right here. Sealed. PS4? PS4 game. What is it? Death Stranding. Okay. And then another sealed item right here. It's a charger, maybe. Yeah. One of those portable no chargers. Backup. Which is great because our kids love those. And then a switcher. Pony Bro. HDMI. Oh, that's good. And then some more cords. Which cool. cords are always great. Yeah. The, Marvel 1-Up. I like those. Tabletop. Can we keep it? If you get rid of Gauntlet, yes. No, I get rid of Gauntlet. Yeah. One or the other. Hmm. 
Oh, batteries, double A. Yeah, Love that. Nice. Let's take those home. Yeah, that's some money. Double A batteries, this is money, baby. That's right. This is uh, a rock, wait, that's Rocky Evo set. Is that what the other one said? Oh, wait, is that the artwork? Oh. That's Rocky Evo set. Box one of two. Okay. Oh, There's another one the same size. Alrighty. Okay. Jack's opening the box. Let's see what's in here. It says do not stack. Locker nuts is back in action. Hmm. Ooh, this is cool. Okay. I'm gonna turn it on. Okay. It says do not stack, so we thought it might be kind of fragile. Oh, oh, that's so cool. 40th anniversary. 40th anniversary. So it's a later. No, it's been. Look, it's been. Oh, it's broken. It's wrecked. Oh. Yeah, it's creased. It's creased. So he never even opened it. He had it shipped to him, and he could have returned it for damage in the mail. Yeah, that's too bad. That sucks. Okay, so we just took one load home in the Tesla, and Noah's over unloading the van right now at our storage locker. Yeah, uh, took a lot of stuff. He did. All the big stuff. So. We're down to this. There's a lot of neat stuff in here. Uh -huh. Not sure what that is, but, but this is cool. Stand for Oculus. Uh -huh. Maybe I'll bring that home for my Oculus. Okay, here's load number two. And I'm getting down to it. I think we can fit it in two loads. Uh -huh. there's, uh, these apparently are some sort of pop art. No pun intended, but that's Popeye. And this is something they bought at some art gallery in San Francisco, apparently. And this, I don't know. Oh, this is a Mickey Mouse right here. Oh, oh this is super cool. This Thank is you. expensive. Yeah, it's cool. Some kind of chrome, huge Mickey Mouse gl glass or ceramic or something. Yeah. It's just with all the recycled boxes. What's it made out of? I don't know. Plastic? Some another piece of pop art right there. Now, that's going to be a hard sell unless you can find the... The artist. It says Coca-Cola condensed tomato. How funny. Huh. Maybe it's like a Banksy or something and we're going to pay our house off. All right, guys, here it is. Almost done. Just have this to sell. Gianna's listing that on Facebook, 100 bucks, And hopefully we can uh, meet someone here tonight or tomorrow and sell it right out of here. We don't have to move it. That was a uh, <laughs> good load. This is a team effort. I think they went a little faster because I was here. Yeah. And then like two and a half loads in the Tesla. It didn't hold very much, but. All right, guys, next day, which is Saturday. Saturday morning, as you can see, it is empty, clean. We just swept it, waiting on this to uh, be picked up right now. Gianna's actually over at the gate to meet the people who are coming to buy it. hundred bucks on Marketplace and um, that did not take long. So it is Saturday. We didn't go to garage sales this morning. I was actually a little bit sore last night. I may have overdone it a little bit. Uh, actually, I probably overdid it the last three days, but my surgeon did clear me for lifting up to 20 pounds. I don't think I've overdone that. I think I've just done too much uh, cumulatively. So I was a little sore last night. So I decided to take the morning off and rest. And uh, I'm glad I did because I feel pretty good. So anyways, we'll get this picked up and then... Uh, we're gonna have some fun going through more boxes. There's a lot more stuff to get through. Okay, we are, it's a few days later, we're home. So we packed these boxes full of stuff from the locker, uh, smalls. Bring home and look through it a little bit closer. All right, let's see what's in here. Okay, another 007 Lotus Esprit S1. This is neat. Get a lot of James Bond type stuff. Spy Who Loved Me, that's pretty cool. Hmm. Auto World. It's a die cast. Hopefully we can look that up and get a comp on it. Maybe this is the number AWSS132. Pretty cool. Xbox. Oh, some more music right here. Duran Duran. Anthony Robbins. Pump up the volume. Pink. A little bit more music. Wireless drone. What? No. How does that work? Flying toy. Okay, look at this. Got some lunch boxes. 007. Live and let die. That is pretty cool. Okay, collectible lunch boxes of two from Live and Let Die. Very nice. Roger Moore. Okay. 
Here's something I don't think we saw before. The Batman pose statue. That is so stinking cool. Very cool. Oh, this is McFarlane toys. All right. Little miniature Pac-Man game. Color. That's cute. Yeah. We already saw the Yoda, so I think we added this stuff to the box to make it a full box. Who doesn't want to see Yoda again, though? So a brand new Godfather. I've never seen this before. It's what is it? 14 plus. Three to six players. Oh, game. Okay, that should sell tonight. It's too bad they open it. That's fine. Yeah. All right. And then we have... So we're going to put him aside because we have to find his lightsaber. Okay. Oh, it's right here. It's that easy. Ah, uh, is it? Yeah. Let's try it. And there's one other thing. There's a there's staff. There's too. The staff's oh, right here. Cool. Oh, look at his head. Yeah. Splitting. Oh, no. That's too bad. Yeah, the one that I had found was all... It was all wrecked, too. These are just not well made. The rubber they use is not very durable. Yeah. So, uh, in here, Ooh. stickers. Portable charger for a PlayStation. We put that in the electronic slot, or... And then this is a whole bunch of Star Wars stickers. Mm, yeah, that, that's cool. A little lot with that. So, Let's take some party stuff, a little frisbee, Star Wars. Yeah, I think someone had a Star Wars. Some Chinese yo-yos. Yeah. It's an ink cartridge. Okay, that's it. Yeah, so we had a little Star Wars party. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. The next box. Next box. Oh, this is more video game. Oh. Neo Geo Arcade Stick Pro. Oh, brand new. Jeez, alone. Do we have the new? That's the receipt. How much was it? A hundred and one dollars. Wow. Okay, that's good. Fine. Have to return it from Amazon. Another hundred bucks. So eighty percent of these items they say were brand new. There's Matrix Resurrections. I haven't even seen that. Maybe we'll watch that. Let's watch that. That's great. I haven't seen it. Um, and what's this? Amazon Glow. So three and up. Another like game, perhaps. No, no, we're careful pulling it. It's gonna rip. Okay. What's an Amazon Glow? It's sealed. It's sealed brand new, so I'm not gonna open it. Hmm. Okay. I think it's a kid's game. Something. A lot of Amazon purchases. Hmm, that's interesting. I bet you that's not cheap. Yeah. It's got some weight to it. We will definitely look that one up. So the guy would buy stuff, obviously, on Amazon as well as other places and just have them shipped directly to the storage facility and the manager would put the boxes into the unit. So that's a little different. All right. What's this? Ah, I don't know. post -it Express. Magic Expo. We liked a lot of magic stuff. What is this though? Vanishing. So this might be some sort of magic stuff. Yeah. I, I don't know. We're going to have to make a little stack of magic stuff. Yeah. But it says Vanishing Ink right here too. Hmm. Same as that. Vanishing. This is another thing. And it's brand new sealed. This has got post-it notes in a deck of cards. This is some more uh, magic stuff. This is like a book. Of what? Limited? I don't know. But I have these movies. I think this is maybe all magic. I have these movies to sell inside. So oh, you do? Yeah. Murphy's Magic. So this is more magic stuff. So I think all the magic stuff we're going to have to put aside and sell to a, a magician if we can find one. Do those, magic. Do those exist? Are there still magicians in the world? Just, uh, this doesn't look cheap though. This looks like it's custom made maybe. Yeah, maybe. Kind of expensive. So... A lot of it comes in the original boxes so I can look up that person he bought. Alright, let's try to get all the magic Water. in this box. Okay. Pack me and ponchos. That's heck of cute. Yeah, now this is the stuff that was on the shelf. I know this box came from the shelf. 20 bucks each. That's good. You can put that in auction. In what auction? What not auction? Uh, where, when, when do we do that? Uh, Monday night next week and Friday night next week. So we do it twice a week usually and check our website lockernuts.com to find out when. Oh, this is a shoulder hol holster. Mm -hmm. So that's actually pretty cool. Yeah. I think we'll have to list that. Right? Unless I need a shoulder holster. You don't. I kind of do though. You don't. I kind of do though. 
Well, anyways, guys, come to our whatnot show. You'll be able to buy a lot of this stuff. Uh, the stuff we're showing right now, a, a large part of it's going to be gone already. But there's so much more. There's so much more. Um, and, oh, here's a Funko Pop right here. Oh, that's cute. We've had we'll that, that before. we we'll definitely put that in the, in the whatnot auction. We're doing one tonight. A party game. Clue this. Sealed. And it's still sealed. Nice. Brand new. This is good right here. Dual Shark 4 PS4 controller. That's amazing. Very good. That was a brand new seal. Okay. Ooh, Fantastic Four. Human Torch. Well, action figure. That'll go tonight. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, we do these auctions every, or twice a week, really. Usually every Friday and then either like a Thursday. I mean, every Monday and then a Thursday or Friday after. We looked in there. Mm -hmm. And that's, uh, where was that going to go? Market? Yeah. It's empty, guys. If you guys haven't seen whatnot before, this is what it looks like on a computer. All right, it's going to look different on a computer or your phone. I suggest using your phone or a tablet because you can't enter giveaways on the computer. And uh, let's just pop in one of these here. This is caveman right here. Let's see. What are they selling? Trey. Oh, they selling some uh, jewelry. So I've got some uh, Jensen. Here's our friend, the storage auction pirate. He's got a show later today. Let's go ahead and bookmark that. Uh, silver cups. So come by and check out our, our auctions. You can buy some of this stuff, usually for a great deal. This stuff's been going super cheap. Ooh, uh, this is, well, this is it's a great looking box right here. Yeah, all right, James Bond die cast. And all this stuff's gonna be sold and delivered before Christmas, so. Yeah, more James Bond. Nice. It's fabulous die cast. Yeah, I like it. That's neat. Mm -hmm. little, little models, this, this stuff's cool. Oh, James Bond's always cool. Very cool. cool. Thor. What's that? A Christmas ornament? Mm -hmm. hmm. Here's a Batmobile. This is super cool. Hot That's Wheels. From the new movie. Nice. Yeah, people were asking for Hot Wheels the other night. Yeah. The 007, right? Mm -hmm. Ashton Martin. Nice. There's a original Rubik's Cube, authentic Rubik's Ooh, Cubes. Fun. Yeah. Lord of the Rings. Of the Rings. Sauron. Neat. Mm -hmm. Sell so that tonight. Ah, Frankenstein. Yeah, we have one of those. We did, right? Is this that it? No, this is a different. We have a different figure in there. And actually, huh. those have some decent value. I looked them up. Yeah, the guy collected these old, the classic horror. Oh, yeah, the Batman. People were asking for that. Oh, that's so Adam West. So right cool. There. Yeah. We had one of these, Dr. Freeze, and it sold the other night. Switch accessory. Okay, great. A leg, leg strap. Leg strap, How huh? funny. I've never seen that. There's another 007. Rubik's Cube. Huh, that's another one. That's cool. We have a quite a oh, these are of neat. But what's this? King Kong. They got the new movie Godzilla and King Kong coming out. So I expect this stuff to sell pretty well. Oh, yeah. You never know. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that one's super cool. It's got two different heads. You can switch his look. Got two different hands. That's huh. kind of funny, actually. Yeah. <laughs> that's neat. This is a great box. A great box. Okay. This will go on a Monday for our variety show. Okay. Tonight we're trying to do just toys. Yeah, so totes. Extra Memory. large. That's great. 11 to 12. Mm -hmm. Captain Scarlet. Yeah, that's cool. Pre try me. Press my chest. Uh -huh. I don't know. Is it supposed to sound that way? I don't know. Huh. Exploding minions? Exploding minions. It's like exploding kittens. Yeah, it's so cute. Mm hmm That's a good game. Mm -hmm. This is cool. Star Wars. Mm -hmm. You liked Star Wars. This is... Swing. How funny. Action. Help. Help. That's cute. Space. Yeah, that's cool. And then Rockport Shoes. Hmm. Just the receipt. Brand new. True Tech. Ooh, those are nice ones. Yeah. Shoes. All right. What size are those? I, mean, I don't know. Big size. Let's see. 11 wide. Oh. Neo Geo mini pad. Neo Geo. We've had some, quite a few of that. Yeah. It's another video game controller, I think. Up. Oh, Charger cable. Slot. I got it's a for a PlayStation. Oh, okay. Both the video games. Let's see what this is. Video games. Oh, great. Destiny. I'll nice. PS4. Up. Had a little lot with that. Ooh, Betrayal at the house. House on the Hill. It's nice. It's like a horror board game. Let's see if it's not sealed, but it looks new. Oh, yeah, it hasn't been cut out. Oh, yeah, they're not punched out. That's yeah. kind of cool. So it's not sealed. Hmm. Okay. 
switch. This is nice. Look at this case. Oh, maybe Camille needs that. Our mount. Yeah. Yeah, we can ask her. She was saying she needs one for her car. Okay. Well, we'll put it in the electronic slot and you can ask her. Yeah, this is nice right here. Guys, we have so many nice cases. We are going to have some killer electronics. Projection light here. Batman. That is no. sealed. Yeah, sealed. It's a nice little toy. Mastermind Remastered. It's another game right here. Sealed. And sealed. Joke King. Huh, another brand new game. This is great stuff for Christmas presents. Oh, I know, right? It's perfect timing. Okay, and then in here we've got... These are not going to go on whatnot. These would be hard to ship. I think we're going to try to sell these locally. This is a Simpsons arcade machine. Uh, very cool. Bowling, huh? Simpsons bowling. So I think what our goal on this is going to be... Well, this one I think is the one Jan already listed right here. 400 bucks. This sells for five to 600 bucks. And uh, getting a lot of call, uh, offers on this stupid lowball moron offers. 200, 250. Uh, it's 600. 400. We priced it 400 to sell it. It's brand new in the box. If we don't sell it, we don't sell it. This one we haven't looked up yet, but super cool. We just got to get these listed so hopefully we can sell them before Christmas. This has been taped and we never opened it, huh? Nope. So no clue what's in this one. Oh, oh two totes. Okay, this is great. This is stuff can go right into tonight's auction. So this is his older collectibles. These are from were stored at his parents' house before going into oh, the storage wow. locker. Wow. Okay, guys. Ooh. Wow. Todd McFarlane, sea creature playset. And this stuff is a little bit older. Yeah, it was 1998 right here. 97. This is great. Lady Death. What's this one? Um, right here. Dr. Frankenstein. Monsters. Monsters. That's great. These are like classic horror. Mm -hmm. Phantom of the Opera. So cool. Wow. All McFarlane's on these. Wet Works. Another comic book title. Another Lady Death. And... Lady Death's not Todd McFarlane, it's something different. There's an old Spider-Man, that's cool. Yeah, that's cool. cool. Mm, that's, that looks older. 94. Good eye. And a witch blade. Witch blade, another comic book title. And a cap. And here we got some loose toys. This is 1998. Lost in Space Robot. Got to get it put back together. Unfortunately, they let it get knocked around. Star Wars Death Star right here. That's cool. Oh, wait, this does something. I can't do it with one hand. Let me put this down. Oh, it's got... <laughs> Darth Vader. Darth Vader sitting there. Oh, that's cool with his helmet off. Mm -hmm. Or partially off. Yeah, that's kind of neat. It's all right. It goes on that. And then what's this guy do? Maybe there's some figures in there. Is that Jabba? Yeah. Hmm. Maybe this way? Huh. I think these are micro machines. Yeah, they're like little things. Galoob Toys, 97. Mm -hmm. mm. He's popped out right here. Yeah, it is. It's popped out there. So I'll just I'll have to get that with some of this later. This tote is gross. Tote's gross. Oh, wow. That, that looks like rats. Okay. Mm -hmm. What do we got here? Earthworm Jim. Huh. Bob and number four. That is cool. That looks nice. Little turtles. What year is it? I don't know. This is 94 right here. This is actually kind of neat. I've never seen Earthworm Jim action figures before. Da Battle damage Earthworm Jim. Look at this stuff. This is so cool. Hench Rat and Evil the Cat. They're in really good shape too. The Easy. cardboard on these. He's got this stuff boxed up. This is more Micro Machines, I think, right here. Mm -hmm. That's what it looks like. These are Star Wars Micro Machines. It's just on it. Oh, She-Hulk. They have it all, like, he has it all bagged by, like, individual pieces, I think. They go this is pretty cool. There's a... There's the Brood. Kirk. This is X-Men. That's cool, Kirk. Yoda, Power of the Force. We have some of those in there. Mm -hmm. Did you look these up? Uh-huh. The Thing. It's from the Adams Family. Yeah. And, oh, what's that? It's an ornament. 
Dayton's 24 karat gold finish. Minnesota. A little tourist thing. Here's more Micro Machine Star Wars. This is a really good Star Trek phaser. <laughs> That's cool. Got a Spidey. This right here. 1998. Do you recognize this guy? No. This is from Spawn right here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that is so cool. These are cool. Look. Star Trek Micro Machines. Another character down the bottom here. A couple. Oh, no. uh, let's okay. get it. I'm, no, don't pull it out. I'm worried we'll pull it off the card, you know. No, Too much stuff in here. <laughs> 1994 right here. Whatever that guy is. Electronic handbook. Keys for writers. Here, you want to put some in here? That guy's wicked looking too. See who that is? No, he's a screw head. Crazy, nut head, nut head. A lot of these are. Ah, look at this. X-Men. Blood mobile, huh? Mm -hmm. A lot of minis. So, I love the little Star Wars. That's the tick. The fly or something. Mm -hmm. huh. This is a great find, right? Yeah, it's fun. Another Star Wars. Do micro machines. No. A lot of cool. Oh, whoa. Whoa, shot up. Wait a second, Gianna. That's... This is sealed, brand new right here. Oh my god! It's got a little tear in the plastic, but this is sealed. If this is an alpha deck, this is 40 grand. What? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. What year is that? Um... Let's look, let's get some... We'll have to go look this up. That. This, that is potentially something. Woo! Okay, wait, let's look at these things real quick. Okay, Godzilla right here, Rodan. Little Godzilla figure. That's X Men right here. Just one sealed box of magic at the bottom of that. Wow. Now you're hurrying to get through it. You're like, let's go. Yeah, this stuff's neat, but it's, the loose figures aren't going to bring in big money. This one's cool. What's oh, that? Oh, wait. I don't know what that Ooh, is. Star Wars. This. Yeah, what's this? This looks like 70s. Hey. This could be better, guys. We weren't really thinking vintage toys in this locker. Yeah. Everything well, was newer. It's just he bought high end toys and he spent big money. Some of his old personal collection was in the boxes in the back. Okay, this is 1995. This Power of the Force, the newer stuff. What is that? I don't know. That's funny. 1995. This is newer stuff. This is cool. Let me check him too. 1995. I don't know. We'll have to look it up. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, this is Spawn. This big one at the bottom here, Spawn. Is that Spawn? This is cool. I can't believe Spin action hand. Back. Overkill. That's amazing. Yeah, this is neat too. All right, let's go look at this magic. For sure. Yeah. I'm gonna put this over here so we can look that up. Okay, so here's our magic WOC. That's Wizards of the Coast 6100, and that is sealed. Brand new, and what we got right here, brand new, $950. Wow. Sealed, revised, starter pack. Sold. Yeah, these are sold prices from the United Kingdom. This looks like the same one sold twice. Maybe they didn't pay or something. Let's see what else we got. Not a lot of Not many around. Comps. Let me see about, that's the sold price, guys. So let's look at listed. There's 300 for pre-owned. Open, though. Yeah. Pre-owned, pre-owned, nobody cares. That's not a good comp. This is a different version right here. Looks like it's from 95. Huh. Wow. Okay, that's not great. Let's go. Okay, let's go look at worth point. Oh, okay. This one, holy smokes, 1495 bucks in 2021. And this one, 2300 bucks. Yeah, These are 1994. Sealed? It looks like this is the same listing sold twice. Again, maybe someone didn't pay. And yeah, those are sealed. Just like ours. It's just like ours. I, I uh, so we see the recent one sold for nine hundred, right? But there's none listed. Could there be a card worth more than nine hundred in there, though? Oh, I don't know. That's my question. Like, could there be a twenty thousand dollar card in there? So there's only really one comp, nine hundred and fifty bucks. That's the same listing sold twice. They probably didn't pay, so then they had to sell it again, or something happened. That's not, and there's none listed right now for sale. So as of a couple of years ago, they were selling for more. And it could be that the prices come down in the last couple of years, but okay. Now we got something. 
because um, if there's none anywhere listed on eBay right now, uh, we basically set the price. So it doesn't matter if one sold for 950, it doesn't matter because mm -hmm. there's none available for 950. So we set the price. I think we're gonna probably list that at like two grand. That's what I was thinking too. Yeah, and this, if we don't sell it, it don't matter because that is a rare piece. Wow guys, right here. kind of exciting. <laughs> There's no discussion of magic cards in this locker. That's that's probably the most expensive magic find that I've ever found. Well, let's get it listed. I'm gonna list it now. Okay, all right, well. What about this? Should we look these up real quick? The Doom Trooper, who knows? No, you know, we'll look it up later. Okay. Um, but that's, uh, yeah, if it has value, we'll update you guys, but I'm, I don't think it does. It's open. So um, anyways, that's a good dig, right? Mm -hmm. Good, good dig. Yeah. So as you guys saw, uh, Noah came to help us and moved everything into our locker. That's where we pulled all these boxes from is from our locker. Everything secured in our place because we only had so much time to get it cleared out uh, on this private party purchase. So if you guys didn't see the earlier um, video or hear us talking about it, we did pay $7,500 for this locker. We feel like we overpaid, quite frankly, but finding something like this could uh, turn the tables. Yeah. So it sure. could make it where we're going to make a little bit of decent profit on it. So very happy about that. Wow. And we saved it till the, that's the last box we opened. We had no There's idea. There's no way to plan that. It just sometimes works out that way. So I kind of want to go back and grab the other box. We have one more like that with the old well, stuff. We have more than one. There yeah. was, there was a, and these, that big box is in the back right corner. So if you guys watched the earlier videos, back right corner had some big sealed boxes that they, they hadn't opened in years and we didn't open to go through. So mm -hmm. here we go. We found something really good. All right. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Come join our whatnot auctions. If I didn't mention it before, make sure you use our link when you sign up for whatnot, because you're going to get a $15 spending credit for free. All right. Just for using the link, but it's only when you first sign up. And if you sign up without using the link, sorry, you're out of luck. You don't get the 15 bucks. So you got to make sure you use that link and we'll put it in the description of the video. It's also on our website, lockernuts.com. That's where you can also find links to our upcoming auction. All right. Thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed it. There's going to be a few more videos like this. I think of us going through this stuff because there's still, there's tons of stuff, right? Yeah, decent amount for sure. Tons of stuff. And we're just barely starting to scratch the surface on selling it. So uh, yeah, come pick up some great stuff from us. All right. Thanks for watching. Till next time. Good luck to you. God bless you. We'll see you next time here on Logger Nuts. Nuts.